St. Louis mourning the loss of blues great Bobby Plager after he was killed in a car accident yesterday. Police have released new details about that crash. They say Plager was driving on Interstate 64 eastbound when his SUV hit a minivan and then hit a concrete wall on the right. His vehicle then crossed all lanes and struck the concrete center median. The driver and passenger in the minivan were not hurt. The power of two's Chris Renier is in downtown with how people are remembering number five. We are outside of the Enterprise Center. A memorial to Bobby Flager has gone up at the main entrance here. You can see there are flowers and other items, including a handwritten note reading in part, Bobby, you were such a legend and a great person. People really all over St. Louis trying to comprehend the loss of this man affectionately known as Mr. Blue. Player was a legendary figure in the St. Louis Blues organization. He celebrated with the team when they finally won the Stanley Cup and was one of the original members of the Blues back in 1967. His number five jersey was retired in 2017 next to his brother's number eight. Player played 11 seasons with the Blues and was known for his hip checks. But he really became a face for the franchise after his playing days were done. He did all kinds of work with the Blues and was a constant figure in the Blues organization for many years. NHL Hall of Famer and Blues TV analyst Bernie Federko, who played with Plager, is among those now remembering him. He was, as I said, he was, he was full of life, and I think that's what really hurts the most. Now, is that he's, I think he had so much still to give. Uh, and I think that the one thing that we're all going to miss the most is that when we go down to the, you know, the enterprise, and, and, and Bobby's not going to be there because we're going to miss that, that story, that joke, that smiling face. And to see him when, when, the, when the Blues won the Stanley Cup, you know, recently, whatever, to see him, he was probably just as excited, if not more, than, than the actual players. So I thought it was fantastic. And it's just, just we, lost a, we, we lost a good one. Just a great human. I mean, uh, just one of those guys that you, you don't replace. You just uh, treasure the time you had with him. Earlier, one man stopped by and added some flowers to the memorial. The Blues' next home game here is tomorrow night. You can bet Plager will be on the minds of those at that game. Bobby Plager was 78 years old. Reporting downtown, I'm Chris Fernier.